Look at that sky. Beautiful this morning. Absolutely beautiful. What a difference between yesterday morning and this morning. Look at the colors there. That horizon. That horizon is on fire. Is that hole big enough for you? Ooh. That might work, yeah. Thanks. Beautiful out here this morning. Absolutely beautiful. Right now, the temperature is about 50 degrees. 50 degrees. Expecting today's high to get up around 73. Kind of interesting. I was watching the temperature as I was driving to the beach. I live about, oh, two and a half miles maybe from the beach here from where I'm standing. When I left my house, the temperature was 51. At the front gate the temp of the park, it was 49. And then out here on the beach, it's 50. So little pockets there as I was driving. It was interesting that the temperature was lower up by the front gate here. Well, thanks for tuning in, everybody. Thanks for being a friend, a follower, a supporter. The tide is slowly making its way out here. Didn't check the tide chart to see exactly what time low tide is here, but it's probably going to be around, I don't know, 8.15-ish, I'm guessing. Beautiful morning. Beautiful, beautiful morning. Had a nice morning yesterday. Even though it was overcast, it was still a nice morning. Every every day is beautiful in its own way out here. Didn't see any dolphins yesterday. Maybe we'll get lucky today and see a couple dolphins. Hit that share button. Let's get some more people on here with us. Get those sleepy heads out of bed. Heck, you don't even have to get out of bed to walk on the beach with me. <laughs> That's the nice thing about these beach walks. You can follow along while you're still under the covers if you want. I'll do the walking for you. Hey, Lori, good morning, dear. Jan, good morning. Fortunately, the wind has died down. Just a little tiny breeze up here this morning, a slight little breeze, nothing much. Gorgeous out here. Very quiet and peaceful right now. Good morning, Becky.
Kira? Is that how you pronounce that? Kira? Good morning. Good morning, Kira. It's on a bit on the chilly side for this Florida boy. When it gets into the low 50s, that's cool for me out here. Sharon, good morning, Sharon. How are you doing today? It's great to meet you down here. Great to see you in person. Dawn, good morning. Becky, good morning. Uh, what's the temperature up there in Minnesota today, Sharon? <laughs> Oh yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. Got a nice little fighting conch here that I want to hang on one of our trees a little later for Donnie's mom. Still sending prayers out to her and sending prayers out to Kelly and Emily and her family, the Powers family. So if you notice, there's a new little symbol up there in the upper left-hand corner of the screen. You see that little star with the zero next to it? That's a new way, something new Facebook just introduced a few days ago, actually. Or I just noticed it a few days ago. They sent me an email. It's another way of showing your support for what I do. It's a little star rating system. For each, for each star that I get, I get one penny. One penny for each star rating. Yesterday, I got 400 stars yesterday morning. That was kind of cool. Somebody figured out how to do it. Yeah, our connection's not so good this morning. Keeps Our connection keeps popping in and out here. It's funny, yesterday we had a great connection and the weather was horrible, very overcast this morning, nice clear sky, and the connection's cutting in and out. Very strange how that works. I was hoping with the new phone it would get better, but apparently not. more the true color right there the camera's having a hard time figuring out what color the sky is right now but that's pretty much the true colors right there what you're seeing very pale yellow good morning lord it's good morning Yeah, 
I'm keeping my eyes open here, trying to see if we see any dolphins out here this morning in the past. They're going if they're moving out into the Gulf, they're gonna be they're gonna fly past as the current is moving really fast going out this morning. So those dolphins will be moving fast out into the Gulf. We'll hang out here for a little while. See if Roy shows up up here. Looking to see, is that an osprey? It looks like that might be an osprey flying around here. Yep, looks like one of our osprey friends circling around the pass. are starting to fade out now. Hey, Linda, good morning. Good morning, Linda. Got a few clouds up there. Got a little pink in them now. A little bit of color. A little bit of color happening there. Beautiful. Kelly, good morning. Good morning, Kelly. Prayers still going out for Kelly. You are in our thoughts and prayers, dear. Look at that water swirling around down there at the bottom of the screen. Good reason why they don't want you swimming out here in Wiggins Pass. There are some strong currents here. There you go, Linda, the electric fireplace. I love it. I don't blame you. It's chilly for us Floridians. Under the covers. I'd like to be under the covers too, but I, for some reason this beach just calls me out in the morning. It's my calling. I th think about sleeping in when it's cool out like this a lot of times, and then my mind starts racing. I'm like, well, what am I going to miss? This is the day. This is the day something great's going to happen at the beach, and I'm going to miss it. So the beach is my inspiration to get out of bed in the morning. And all of you guys, you're a big part of that inspiration. I don't want to let you down.
Well, Kelly is on here, everybody. Well, we got our friend Kelly on here. How about, let's flood that screen with hearts. Let's send Kelly some love. Everybody that's on, send Kelly some hearts. Show her how much we care for her. And are praying for her. Send Kelly some love. Let me see this screen fill up with hearts. Come on. Hearts for Kelly. Love for Kelly. Here we go. Here come the hearts, Kelly. There you go. Look at that. Look at all that love. I can't send any from my end here. Somebody's going to have to send some for me. <laughs> we love you, Kelly. You can keep them coming all morning. That's fine with me. <laughs> Good morning, Jennifer. Some nice colors up there now, some pinks. Yeah, here comes Elsie, making her way up the beach. The water's picking up the pink now of the sky. Got a little pink glow in the water. Good morning. Beautiful morning for a swim. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Maybe later. Maybe later. That's gorgeous. The water with the pink and the pink clouds. That is beautiful right there. Just beautiful. Those reflections. I gotta get a picture of that. Bear with me here, give me a minute. It's beautiful, isn't it? The reflections. Of my I don't know. If there's, I think they're still pump dredging. They are dredging back in there. Because I hear it in the morning. Right, and I can see it. But I yeah, that's it then. They still must be pumping all the sand out here. Yeah. How far back are they? I hear it every they're morning about, over in there. They're somewhere. about three quarters of the way to the boat. Oh, wow. Yeah. I didn't realize it was that low back there. Yeah. <laughs> actually dredging out in the back bay now the dredge is in the back bay back where when we took Roy out on the boat back in that area where we saw the dolphins I hope they don't mess up all the dolphins disturb all the dolphins back there I sure am looking forward to get back there again one of these mornings that is beautiful that is absolutely gorgeous. I'm going to take a quick photo here. Bear with me. I'll be right back. I'm back as promised here. Sorry about that. That is beautiful.
Good morning, Astrid. Good morning. Our good friend Astrid. Working hard, helping people find their dream homes here in beautiful Naples, Florida. If you're thinking about making the move and coming down here, get in touch with Astrid. She puts her heart and soul into finding the perfect home for you. Jojo, Kim, good morning. What a great morning. What a great morning. Thank you for tuning in. It's just absolutely beautiful over there. It's absolutely gorgeous. What can I say? That one cloud, look at it. Looks like an angel with their wings spread out. Maybe a big bird. Can you see that? Good morning, Mark. That is cool. Beautiful colors out there in the Gulf. Absolutely beautiful. Hey, those of you that are monthly supporters of Southwest Florida Television, thank you so much for your commitment. Know those of you there's a, a lot of you out there that aren't into monthly commitments like that but I appreciate having you tag along I appreciate your friendship Facebook has just come up with a new way to show your support if you don't want to make a monthly contribution a regular contribution there's a easier way now you see those little stars I see I just got 10 stars from somebody you can send me some stars. Give me a rating here. Every star, every star, I get one penny for each star that I get in the morning. It's only during my live feeds. You can only do that during the actual live feed itself. But if you like what I do and you want to show a little financial support, it's always appreciated. And now it's even easier with this new star system up there. Nothing special in your coffee, Jan. <laughs> you don't need anything special, Jan. Believe me. <laughs> You're special enough. <laughs> God bless you. You got too much energy as it is. I don't 
don't see Roy yet. Still admiring those colors there. Just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Ooh, behind me, I see the sun reflecting in the windows of the condos down there. The sun is on its way up. I can see the reflection on the condo on the right there. So it'll be coming up over the trees in a little while. Beautiful colors. Beautiful colors this morning. The water's it's not picking up the pink it's like a teal color this morning it's not picking up the color of the sky it's gorgeous our shellers out here our regular morning shellers Ooh, somebody else gave me some stars. Whoever did that, thank you. Up to 60 stars this morning. Yesterday, I got 400 stars. Yesterday was the first day for the stars. I was like, wow. <laughs> 400. That is awesome. I'm trying to figure out how to tell who sends those stars. I can't figure it out yet. It's kind of anonymous on my end but I appreciate it, believe me. Like I say, every dollar counts. Well, every penny counts. <laughs> Good morning. That is just beautiful. Those clouds are really gorgeous this morning. It's High wispy clouds up there. tide is still going out the tide's still going out so it might reveal some nice stuff here some nice shells along the shoreline There's some brave shellers heading out into the water, making their way out to the sandbar over there. Some broken shells down here. Oh, look at this little black scallop shell. It's kind of a nice shell. Add that to Doni's collection, a nice little black scallop. Nice. That is cool. That's a wide one there. A little, I saw a little whelk down here, so what kind of shape that's in. Ooh, that's in good shape. Well, no, it's not. It's kind of pitted on the side there. It looked good from there. The little lightning whelk. Yeah, that didn't show up, Lourdes. I just caught that out of the corner of my eye. I didn't see that. It, was, it should show up in the 
corner up there. I appreciate that. Let me see, Kim. I think I know the answer to that one. You're going to go see Mike. <laughs> I think you're going to go see Mike. We'd like to see you down here. But we all know how much you enjoy Mike. Lots of little fighting conks along the beach. Lots of them lately. Lots of little fighting conch shells. There's a couple of them right down there. Another one over on the left over here. In all different states. I don't know where daddy O's at here. I don't know where the captain is. I haven't seen him out here yet. There's two people out on the little sandbar out there doing some shelling. I hope their trek out there was worth it. Hope they find some nice stuff. There's another person. If you look really close over here on the left out there in the water and you see another sandbar. That tide is still going out, still going out. I wish I could send you some of this weather through the phone here, through the camera. That would be neat, huh? <laughs> this is the best I can do, though. Just share the sights and sounds with you. Maybe someday I'll be able to beam you over here, just like on Star Trek. Beam you to the beach with me through the phone. Wouldn't that be interesting? <laughs> I know some of you are freezing your butts off. see we're up to 110 stars this morning already thank you thank you guys you're all so kind you're all so kind hit that share button let's get some more people on here with us this morning beautiful sunday morning here in paradise Absolutely beautiful. It's amazing the difference in the levels of the water here. High tide sometimes during our walks where the water is all the way up here into the trees.
There was a massive pile of shells out here the other day. I'm gonna see if I can walk around here and find them, see if they're still there. I'm sure they've been shuffled through by now. If they're even here, the tide might have pulled them back out into the water. Where was that at? We were walking along the other morning, a couple mornings ago, and just saw this massive pile of shells up along the tree line. And I don't see him anymore. I mean, it was just an incredibly huge pile of shells. Where was that at? They're all gone. It was right up in here. And now they're all gone. <laughs> I mean, it was a giant pile. I think this is all that's left of them. Just a couple little shells down here now. Hmm. Yeah, it was all back in here. There was just a gigantic pile of shells. Oh, well. They come, they go. Here today, gone tomorrow. Well, yesterday morning, I saw Roy. As I was leaving, I just caught him in the parking lot him and Dave and I said come on Roy tomorrow which is today I said come up with a good thought for the day for us something really good and profound so a little bit later we'll see what he if he came up with something interesting I'll go have a little chat with him later this morning hopefully he's here Some of these old tree stumps and roots are really, really neat looking. They get the algae growing on them. That is really cool looking. The root system of an old tree, probably an old sea grape tree. the connections dropping out this morning it seems when the weather's really nice the connection drops out and when it's overcast and cloudy and rainy the connection's great that's weird some nice little waves breaking out there on the sandbar some pretty good size ones Little hard to see. We'll see him as soon as the sun pops up. Let's see if I can sneak around the back way here. Under the trees and over the roots, under all these branches, and see if I can find a way without tripping and falling on my face here. Quite the obstacle course here, quite the obstacle course. Ugh. It's kind of fun to think about the old original explorers when they first landed on the shores here of Florida. I mean, there was nothing, no trails, just dense, thick woods. 
mangrove trees, bugs. The bugs had to be just incredible. And what they had to do to settle here, the Indians, of course, the first explorers, the Indians, they're actually the first settlers. They were here before us, the Calusa Indians. Now I see the red penguin walking up the beach. I see the red penguin coming up the beach. Our little red penguin coming around the corner here. What's up, Roy boy? Oh, the old steel manatees out, isn't it? Yep, yeah, the old steel manatees oh, trying to warm, warm up. You got your warm coat on this morning. Oh, yeah, I thought it was going to be windy. I thought it was going to be windy. It's not not bad up there no, at all. No wind, but pretty low temp though. Yeah, it was low this morning, 50 when I got out here. Elsie says it was 40 at her home. 40? Yeah. I think she misread her thermometer. Oh, she <laughs> said around 40. It was 49 at, at the front gate. Oh, it was, really? It was 51 at the house when I left, 49 at the front gate, and did 50. They, did they show it there? No, it's in your car. Doesn't your car oh, have no. a, temper, I, a thermometer could be, on know. the dash? <laughs> it should. That fancy Cadillac. <laughs> it's probably got everything in there. I want to look around a little bit. No, it was, it was funny how it varies as I'm driving down here. Yeah? Yep, by a couple degrees. But it was 50 out here on the end. But thankfully not windy. So. Oh, beautiful. But still cold enough for us. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I slept in this morning. Didn't get up till six. You slept in, yeah, okay. Yeah. Didn't get up till six. Maybe. That's all right. You're usually, entitled to sleep in. Usually it's five thirty. It's nice to sleep in in the morning. Well, I had a good night's sleep. Well, old Dave and I watched the old race, horse races yesterday. How did you do that? Oh, on, the, on his TV. Oh, they showed the race live. Oh, sure. Really? Oh, yeah. Nice. Yeah, we had quite a race. It was a good time. So did one of the favorites win? or? Yeah, the favorite the one. The favorite one. He was way out in front, so it was a beautiful race, you know, to see him run, but it wasn't thrilling because he was so far out in front. Oh, wow. It wasn't like Kentucky Derby when there was that. <laughs> remember that? The one running around by itself? Well, no, the Kentucky <laughs> Derby. Remember the lead horse moved over and bumped the Oh, yeah. Second yeah, in the Kentucky, him. yep. And <clears throat> Big disqualification. Yeah. Remember all the yeah. judges were looking it, at it for an hour? The whole thing, the whole derby series. So they had the one horse ran around without a rider on it? Well, they showed that uh, yesterday where he fell off at the... And when the gates opened, yeah, yeah, it tumbled <laughs> off. They showed that. I still think that would have been something if that horse won the race. Yeah, he dashed over by himself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if he'd have won, he'd probably been disqualified because oh, he didn't yeah. have a jockey. <laughs> Put all the jockeys out of business. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what do we need the jockeys yeah, for? Yeah, what for? Uh, the horse knows what he's doing. But they were beautiful horses. Yeah, horses. I bet. Did you happen to print. see how much money it, it paid? Yeah, it said about, oh man, it was like 50 million or 40 50 million, million, wow. It was up there pretty Yeah, big. that was a big race. The yeah. Pegasus. The Pegasus. Pegasus, it was. yeah. Yep. Wow. So you went to Dave's house to watch yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. Nice. I don't have the TV. Nice, nice. Did you do any uh, investigating on phones yesterday? No, I, you know, I'm not going to worry about it. Not going to worry about it. <laughs> Be phoneless? Yeah, we'll see how it works. It's better than being well, homeless. I got a phone, but it's just kind of a go around. Yeah. Where I got to get more time. So I don't know. Just, you know, <laughs> sometimes you just go in and play stupid, and you just go in and let them do all the work for you. Well, they seem to know what they're talking yeah. about. Yeah. Just say, I, I don't know how to do this. what and... they're telling me anyway. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so what you going to do today? Hang around for a while? Yeah, I think so. It's going to be beautiful when the sun comes yeah. up. Yeah. 
It's going to be not 73. It's not going to get too hot today. Oh, there were those big weddings yesterday. Oh, yeah, a wedding out here. How was that? Oh, I got a bunch of kisses from the bride. Oh, she, she was very, very Kisses delightful. from the bride. You crashed the wedding. God bless you. <laughs> well, it wasn't. It was pre-wedding because they didn't get married till four. And ah. I shoved off. Uh, oh, okay. Dave. So you didn't get to play Here Comes the Bride? No, I did play Oh, it. did That's you? That's why I got some kisses. Oh, okay. I yeah, love I it. it early. I love it. I yeah. love it. She was a very charming lady. Yeah. So are you going to go up to the end, or what are you going to do? No, I don't think so, because it doesn't look like I can get around those trees. No, you'd have to. It's a pain in the neck in some of these, some places here. But. Yeah. Well, I'll, um, I'm going to walk down the beach, and then I'll uh, come chat with you. Remember what I asked, said to you yesterday? I got a real good you got, one. You got a good yeah, one? Yeah, Something I, very profound? Transcends all over the thoughts. Oh, my thoughts. gosh. Transcends every, all the other ones? Yeah. I love it. That's a good word, too. There you go. <laughs> we'll save that one, transcends, for yeah. another day. All right. Well, okay. I'll catch up with you here. Everything good this morning? You feeling good? Yeah, I never felt better in my entire life. It's well, there you go. This morning. That's what we want to hear. That's yeah. what we want to hear. Oh, well, Dave and I went out to eat there at Doug's Seafood. Ooh. Had a wonderful bowl of his fish chowder. Oh, man, it's good. Fish chowder? Yeah, fish mm, chowder. I love that. And had I a love lot fish of smoked chowder. salmon. And, oh, man. Was it a creamy chowder or like a... Like a like a broth. No, no, they got a ton of delicious fish in it, and then it had kind of a broth. I love that. Really tasty I love broth. the broth. Yep. So they they got good fish chowder. Mm. Doug seafood. I love I love fish soup. Ah. Yeah, delicious. All right, now you're making me hungry. Gosh darn it. <laughs> <laughs> Head on up to Doug's. Head on over to Doug's for the best seafood in the world. Yeah. Was Never was better. <laughs> All right. Well, be careful walking along here. Hey, there's a clump of foam over there. Yeah, I saw that. A clump of sea. Oh, there's a bunch of it over there yeah. coming in, the sea foam. Need some sun to get the rainbow bubbles. Need to get some sun for those rainbow bubbles. Where's Doni? Where's our friend Doni? I haven't caught her on here. Foamy foam. Foamy foam. I'll see, you, I'll, see I'll see you down the beach. Doni, Doni, where are you at, honey? Yeah, that hat Connie got him is really nice. That is a nice hat. That was a sweet gift. That is a sweet gift. Can you see it? You can see some rainbow rays over there. The sun's coming up. Oh, yeah, there it is. I see it peeking through the trees over there just a little bit. Right in the middle of the screen there. You can see a little there. The sun peeking out. We had some nice colors this morning. We had some nice color this morning, Roy. That was beautiful. The water was pink again. Yeah, all pink. Oh yeah, there it is, right in there. Here, isn't it? There's our sun coming up. Yeah. It's really gonna warm up once that sun comes up. Yeah, I'll be able to shed my fur hat. Shed your fur hat? Probably a little bit later, <laughs> but it looks good on you. <laughs> good. It's very stylish. That was a nice gift. Sure was. I mean. We what? missed the old, you should bring the, keep the old dead animal in your pocket though, just to show it to us every once in a while. <laughs> the dead water raccoon or whatever it was. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I hear him yelp every night. You hear him? You, are you still feeding and watering it? Huh? Are you still feeding and watering the old oh, hat? Oh, no, no, I don't feed him, but he, you don't feed him? he yelps. Oh, that's why he's yelping now? That's why the hair's falling out. <laughs> You should give give him an apple core once in a while. <laughs> oh, Roy. Got to love our friend Roy. Got to love him. Oh, earlier, 
up at the pass, I stuck a couple shells in my pocket here with some holes in them to hang on our one of our prayer trees here. I'm going to hang it on this tree over here. Hang them. I got a cockle shell and I have a fighting conch shell. I want to hang the fighting conch shell for all of our friends. For all of our friends in need of prayers and healing. This fighting conch. You guys know who you are. Help me with names. Anybody out there, if you want to share their names, share your name. I know Kelly. I know Emily, her family, her son, Robbie. Robbie Powers. I have another shell I want to hang just specifically for our friend Doni's mom. But I want to hang this fighting conch for all of our friends in need of prayers, in need of healing, that aren't feeling well. Come out here closer to the water, find a little branch. Hopefully it won't break off. That looks like a pretty sturdy little branch there. If I can work the shell down on it. Yeah, that's nice and sturdy. Well, that shell is for all of you guys needing prayers. God bless all of you. Just give you a minute here if you want to say some prayers for a loved one. Amen, amen, amen. And now, I wish Tony was on here with us. This is going to be for her mom, this big cockle shell. Find another nice branch here. Something that'll be out over the water when the tide comes in. Maybe right out here on this branch here. That's got a nice big hole in it. I can probably slip it over this branch right here. Yep. Come around. And that. Ah, got a big branch in front of me here, but that shell is for Donnie's mom. Donnie, if you're watching, that shell is for your mom there, honey. We're all thinking about her, and looks like she's making a recovery, which is great news. Great news. But that shell is for your mom, Doni. Please, I'll take a picture of it, and you can share it with her later. God bless the both of you. You're in our prayers. is the old steel manatee. The old steel manatee is sticking up there. The sun's just starting to hit the water out there. Beautiful with the waves breaking. Just gorgeous. That is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Care and prayers for Ellie. Yep. Meg, Ryan. Uh, 
That is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. That one cloud up there. Beautiful blues. Oh, I see we're up to 135 stars this morning. 135 stars. Awesome. Thank you, folks. Thank you for the stars this morning. Can you spot the steel manatee out there? Can you see it out there right in the center of the screen? Right in the middle of the screen. mystery of the steel manatee. Nobody knows. Oh, I see I got some more stars. Up to 160 stars. Sweet. You know, Facebook is finicky. Sometimes, you know, it's, it's best to just delete Facebook from your tablet or from your phone. Or whatever you're watching on, delete the app and reinstall it. I do that well, probably once, at least once a week. At least once a week with Facebook. I use a different program for Facebook. I use Facebook. It's called Facebook Page Manager. But... I find myself deleting that at least once a week and reinstalling it. Because I, I have problems seeing comments as well here. Sometimes I don't see everybody's comments. Sometimes I don't see anything. But you do know you can swipe the screen to make the comments go away. You can swipe the comments on and off. And also, if you hit the red, the little live button up there, it tells you where I'm at oh Jan a star in Hollywood <laughs> that's funny I'll have a star in Hollywood I don't know if I want everybody walking over my star in Hollywood <laughs> I'm happy with everything just the way it is. I want Roy to have the star in Hollywood. Let's give Roy that star. Ooh, if he stuck around a little while longer, he'd be able to see the rainbow bubbles in the sea foam. Starting to see all the little rainbow bubbles here. he's at if he's up here still standing on the beach yeah there's two ladies up here so Roy's up here on the beach he's not going anywhere <laughs> of course lots of big clumps of foam though see it out here that's a huge one up there that's a huge clump of sea foam
See if you can see the little rainbows and the bubbles here. I'm going to try to zoom in on them. Can you see the little rainbows there? The little iridescent rainbows in the bubbles? Got to catch it just at the right angle. Roy loves looking at those. His rainbow bubbles. Hey, Roy. Roy. Uh, he's got it. He can't hear me with that darn hat on. <laughs> hey, Roy. we're getting our rainbow bubbles we're starting to get our rainbow bubbles now yeah the big clumps are getting more of the little rainbow bubbles on them <laughs> it is beautiful again it is beautiful it's always beautiful it's always beautiful, just in a different way. Oh, that pink sea this morning, man. Oh, yeah, it was, that water was really pink this morning. Beautiful. Haven't yeah. seen any dolphins, though, have you? No. Did you notice any going by? Not any yesterday, either. Did none yesterday? No. I don't know if that dredge is chasing them away. They're, they're apparently they're in the back here dredging now behind us. Oh, really? Yep. That's where we saw all the dolphins. Remember when we went back there? Yeah. I can't wait to do that again. I feel the sun warming my back. Yeah, the sun's popping up here, starting to light. Oh, yeah, now it's hitting that big clump of foam over there. That's, a, that's one of our icebergs. Ah, uh, yeah. I'll that's one of that. our Florida icebergs floating over there. Right there. There's one of our Florida icebergs floating around. Oh, look, it's kind of turning. I'm going to go take a look. You, I knew your curiosity was going to get the best of you. <laughs> Over he goes to check it out. Look for his rainbow bubbles. Hopefully it stays out in the sun. It's running away from you. <laughs> Look at them all. Oh, and now it's coming towards them. <laughs> you and your rainbow bubbles. I love it. I love it. I love it. He's just fascinated with that. See if it goes back out into the sun. Huh. Yep. Yeah. That seagull wants to know what you're looking at. <laughs> I think it's going to come out into the sun again over here. Ah, it's just moving, it's blowing back and forth. It's like a big fuzzy caterpillar or something. <laughs> Come on. 
get out in the sun. And now there's waves coming the other way, going to push it back. There it goes. See how the color was? Yeah. Teeny. Yeah, the one, yep. Neat. Coming in closer for you. Yeah. This is kind of like watching a dolphin <laughs> swim down the beach. <laughs> Ooh, now it's picking up speed. <laughs> Roy and his sea foam. I love it. I love it. I love it. I had to get a picture of that. A man and his sea foam. <laughs> uh. Oh, I got to get a picture of that face. It's beautiful. Beautiful. That sky behind you is just beautiful. That blue sky. The sun warming up. Let's see if we can get a big piece of this sea foam. If we can pick it up. Let's see if we can grab a hunk of it. There you go. There's your foam. You can see the little rainbow bubbles in there. Look, look how light that is. <laughs> yep. Can you believe it? Isn't that something? Yeah. <laughs> Pulling the tree or something. It's disappearing. I wonder what color is that? It's something in the, some kind of algae is in the water or something. It's nothing harmful. It's nothing bad. Nothing that's going to hurt you. Oh, it is something in the water. Yeah, yep. You can, if you Google sea foam, it tells you about it. But it's nothing that's going to hurt you. I get it. Wash my hand off here. It's kind of funny. It turns brown. As it dries out. Going back and forth in the current. Doesn't take much to amuse us, does it, Roy? <laughs> Little sea foam, and we're happy. Well, that's part of the interesting parts of nature. It is. There's so many different things out here. Everything's interesting. Well, Good morning, Phil. Hi. Everything in its own little way is special out here. Yeah. Even the sea foam. <laughs> Did you ever see our friend Lori out here yesterday? Lori Cochran? No. From Canada? You think she came yesterday? I was hoping to see her. I think, I don't, I don't know if she's leaving today or tomorrow. I was hoping to see her. Get one last hug in. Yeah. Hey, did you get a calendar from somebody? Yeah, I got some beautiful calendars. That, did, Jackie, she made a calendar for me, for me and Gail with pictures of me and you and down here at the beach. Yeah, and yeah. She gave me one, boy. That was sweet. Our good friend Jackie. I can't wait. She's going to, I hope she's going to move here. <laughs> I hope she makes the move. Yeah. She'll be fun. Be fun having Jackie out here in the mornings with us. Kim had mentioned something about maybe coming down here this morning, but she sounded like she was sitting on the fence, not sure. Saw 
of something over here caught my eye. The heck? Oh, a little, a little pen shell, a little tiny pen shell. Cool. I think I'm going to keep that. A little baby pen shell. Add it to the Dhoni collection. A little pen shell. Cool. Hopefully it won't break in my pocket here. They're so fragile. I've broken so many shells putting them in my pockets. Broken my share of angel wings. Man, some big, beautiful angel wings. I've bent over and crushed them. Well, I think I'm going to turn around here shortly and start making my way back up the beach. morning What's that? Piece of a big shell. Old fighting conch. I thought it was a big whelk. Well, Karen and Tom and Scott and Linda should be coming out here. Yeah, they usually come out on Sunday, yeah, hang out for a while. Tomorrow, Barb will be out here with their shells. Yeah. She'll be out here Monday morning with their shell collection. Always nice seeing her out here. Oh, boy. Well, I'm gonna get my chair. Get your chair set up? All right, well, I'll, I'll be back down to chat with you in a little while. Hey, I can't good. wait for that thought. Good, good. I can't wait. Roy says he's got a good one for us today, so we'll, you'll have to check back later, watch the video to see that. But what a great morning. What a beautiful morning it has been, man. What a difference. From, good morning. What a difference from yesterday morning with all the fog and low clouds yesterday. Now look at it. Look at that sky. Whew. And the water, absolutely gorgeous. Now I'll start heading back up the beach. Up, oh, I just saw 15, how many more stars? 25 more stars showed up, up to 185 stars this morning. Thank you, folks. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I do appreciate it. I do appreciate it. Every little bit helps, believe me. Those little stars up there, that's something new Facebook started doing. Another way of showing your support for what I do out here, an easier way. I think it's an easier way, I don't know. We have monthly supporters. We have regular monthly supporters, which are wonderful. I thank you 
monthly supporters. Then we have folks that just send little contributions now and then, little tips via PayPal. You can find a link to my PayPal account in the description of this post. And I do thank those of you that do that. Some wonderful people do that almost on a regular basis. Some on a regular basis, actually, and I do appreciate that. And then there's this new little star, oh, up to 210 stars. I just glanced there up to 210 stars. That is um, another way of supporting me, showing your support. That I get for each star. Facebook says I get one penny for each star. I'll, I'll believe it when I see it. There's usually always some fine type there where they take money out of it. I don't know. Anything that has to do with Facebook, they take money. They take their share, believe me. But it is what it is. You know, they offer an incredible social media platform for everyone to use for free. So I'm not complaining. If that percentage they take helps keep the platform alive, they're entitled to it. I mean, they provide a great service to everyone. I mean, just being able to do this live is just incredible. Live in the mornings from the beach of North Naples. That is amazing. From my cell phone. Who'd have thought, huh? Who'd have thought? Who'd have thunk it? <laughs> 20 years ago. Who'd have thought we'd be doing this? You're FaceTiming with your grandchildren. Remember when they just live phone calls with video images? That was just like on the Jetsons. That was in the cartoons. That was futuristic. Well, now that has come true. Video phone calls and video conferencing. Everything's now, now, now in this world. Now, now, now. No more waiting around. Everything happens now. Gosh, it wasn't that long ago when the fax machines came out. Remember when faxes came out? How neat we thought they were? All the racket they made when the fax was coming through. <laughs> then when cell phones first became affordable and, and compact... Remember the old cell phones? You had two boxes you'd carry around. Then they were huge, and then all of a sudden, bam, out came the Blackberries and the flip phones. I think I have, I still have one of my old flip phones. They still make flip phones. There's still people that are comfortable with the flip phone. They don't want to go into an iPhone or an Android. You know, you get comfortable doing things a certain way. And change is hard for a lot of people. It's just gorgeous out here. Absolutely gorgeous. That blue sky is incredible this morning. The trees and the blue sky, absolutely gorgeous. Well, I've got to get moving up the beach. I got things I have to do today. Primarily try to make some money. <laughs> get out and do some deliveries for Uber Eats today. it'll be busy out there. I think next Sunday with the Super Bowl should be a busy day. Probably be delivering a lot of pizzas to Super Bowl parties. I'm 
Super Bowl what is it yeah next week right you can tell I'm a huge football fan <laughs> something about watching those overpaid jocks just doesn't excite me especially the way some of them behave they act like a bunch of little babies And a lot of them are disrespectful to our country, to our flag. I can't stand them. I'd like to just boot them right out of the country. Looking up here in the osprey nest, no action up there. Don't see anything going on up in the osprey nest this morning. It's right up in there, up in between those two trees, right in there. <sighs> Nothing happening up there this morning. I haven't seen, oh, I saw one osprey flying around the pass this morning. But that's it. None in the trees. Beautiful colors, though. Just amazing, the blues and the greens. Mm. The white clouds. So blessed to be out here and be able to walk the beach with my friends. Gorgeous. The water is looking really good here. Really, really good. No signs of red tide anywhere in southwest Florida. I didn't see any on the map actually anywhere, but I think that is behind us, finally behind us, all of the red tide. The water's cooling down, which that red algae does not like the cooler water temperatures. The water's down to about 67 degrees. morning. A 
love these waves out here as they just roll in. The sight and the sound. Beautiful looking up to the north there. Beautiful views this morning. The sun coming out, starting to warm up nicely. It's gonna be another great morning here. Might see a little rain through the night and in the morning tomorrow. Another front, I think another front's moving through. Let's see what happens. Not a lot of rain, if we see any rain. We do need rain though. We do need some rain down here. It's getting kind of dry. over here and check our shells real quick that I hung this morning. Our fighting conch shell, so you make sure that's still here, safe and sound. Still here, thank goodness, there's the shell that was for all of our friends in need of prayer that can't come out to the beach and hang a shell on their own. That's for you guys, anybody in, that needs some healing or whatever, prayers for you guys. That shell is for all of you that can't make it to the beach to hang a shell on your own. Not just for you, but for any friends or family members. And over here, Donnie. I did not see Donnie on with us this morning. I hope everything's okay. But I hung a shell special. Just special for Donnie's mom, this beautiful cockle shell over here. That is for your mom, Donnie. I hope you get to see that. I'm gonna take a picture of it for you and send it to you. Prayers going out to Donnie's mom. Well, I think I'm going to call it a morning here as far as the live feed goes. I'm going to go get in my car and head down the beach and go have a little chat with Roy. He promised a good thought for the day, so I'll share that later. Again, thank you for the stars there. 210 stars today. 210 stars. Thank you so much. Thank you for being so generous. I love knowing that you enjoy what I do and appreciate what I do out here. Thank you. Thanks for being a friend. Just thank you for being a friend. Be sure to tell your friends about what we're doing out here. Invite them to tag along with us, please. The more, the merrier. The more friends, the merrier. One last look around here.
That blue sky is just incredible. Absolutely gorgeous. Wow. Hey, thanks for watching, everyone. Tally ho. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rob Stan. God bless.